Okay. All right. Um, Perry, what size of jeans do you wear? <laughs> I wear 30, uh, 38 waist. Yeah, I wear 38, 36 waist size. That's the US size though, but I, I believe it's the same thing here too. When are you coming to London? I will be in London very soon. Maybe not this year, but definitely early next year. Definitely early next year. Um, visit Kenya too. I will definitely visit Kenya. Kenya has always been on Kenya, South Africa, Ghana. Those places have been on my um, list of to-go places. Okay, I'm trying to get through these questions. Ah. <laughs> Is there anything you saw when you left the house that shocked you? A um, couple of videos, yeah. A couple of videos actually surprised me. Things that I didn't know were going on in the house. Yeah, I saw them, but yeah. I mean, that's, that's just normal. Um... Questions, questions. What's your favorite thing to do on free time? <laughs> do you play video games? I love video games a lot. I play video games. I actually love playing um, FIFA, um, FIFA soccer, and I also, I also love playing Mortal Kombat. Those are my two games because I like I like fighting games. I like competitive games because I'm very competitive. Um, yeah, I do love playing. And then. My favorite thing to do in my free time, exactly, you won't believe it, but um, watching movies. I love to Netflix and chill. I just love a relaxed environment where I can just, you know, just chill and just, just zone out for a little bit. Forget about life's problems, man. Because the problems of life too much. General Adesua from Ogun States. What is your next plan after BBN? <coughs> My next plan after BBN, of course, to focus on the career that I left to go to BBN, which is acting and also music. And I'm open to hosting events, hosting shows, just all around entertainment, man. Yeah. Do you like Boma in the house? Of course. Boma's a cool dude. He's a cool dude. Please say my name, Michelle. I just said Michelle now, Michelle. Um, when are we hearing your songs? Very soon, very soon. I have a special announcement that I'll make next week regarding something big that will be happening in December in Lagos. So you guys watch out for that. Um, it's regarding music. So, watch out for that announcement. It's it's gonna come hot. <clears throat> it's gonna come hot. What is your favorite sport? Do you you seem like a golf guy? I love golf. I love playing golf. Um, but my favorite sport's not golf. My favorite sport's actually basketball. Why didn't you go and meet Samuel? <laughs> I know, I know, I know a lot of you have been asking me why I didn't go meet, meet the, um, the governor of Lagos State, but um, I was preoccupied. I really tried everything within my schedules to make it happen. I couldn't, but then I will definitely meet the governor. And Mr. Governor, I thank you so much for your support and for the love for the states. And hopefully great things and better things will be done in your government for this state of Lagos and for the people of Lagos State. Thank you. Um, <laughs> where's Cro Cross just asked the question? <laughs> did you see Cross's question? Where, where is this? What did Cross say? <laughs> Cross, ask that question again. I, I will be tired you there. If you don't ask that question again, we'll be tired. you. <laughs> we'll be tired you there. Where is Cross's question? I'm looking for it. I can't even find it here. There's a lot of questions, man. I can't even find the question, dude. Oh, wow. Okay. So I think... 
Who did I go home with? <laughs> Who did I go home with last night? I went home with the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth cross. Like for real? I went home with Jesus of Nazareth. <laughs> and I'm still home with Jesus of Nazareth. Okay. Ah. Uh, are you Imarose Shippa? I am not an Imarose Shippa, but I admire their relationship. <laughs> Somebody said, would you marry Licka Rose if she was available? Hell yeah. Licka's a cool girl, man. She's a very admirable person. She's really cool. I like her. Um... Tell us more about your scar on your hand. Um, so this scar on my hand, um, this is on both sides actually. So right there. I don't know if you can see the um, the thing. I don't know if it's showing. So it's right here. It's long, you know. And then this one here. So many years ago. Um, this was when I turned, uh, Jesus, how old was I? I was, I was in my, it was in my twenties, early twenties, about 19, 20, maybe 21. Um, we had an accident. I, myself and my mom and my younger sister right here in Oshodi were going to church for a night vigil and we had so the bus we took stopped at Oshodi, and then from Oshodi we were supposed to, we were supposed to take another bus again to um, church for a night vigil. We had a program. It was, a, I think, about a 40-day night, a 40-day prayer and fasting program at church. And when we highlighted the bus at Oshodi, we were about to, you know, just cross the express to the other side to take a bus, another bus. And there was a vehicle parked right by the side of the road and there were just buses lined up by the side of the road so we had come down there from that particular bus and we're just trying to cross but then this other bus behind the bus we came down from was trying to get into the freeway and all of a sudden you know they i don't know the driver wasn't paying attention he didn't know that we were there probably he actually just came out made his way out of the uh, parking area and then was trying to get on the freeway and then brushed us against this bus that was parked and it pressed us against the bus and I fell. <laughs> I was trying to use my hand to support myself, not to fall, but the bus zoomed. So with the with the, the force at which the bus moved and I was static, I immediately fell and my hand broke. So what I did was um, they had to take me to the doctor. That's one. And then that's another one. They had to take me to the doctor to do um, surgery. So the two bones here got broken. I had to put metal. Um, they, they, the doctors had to put a metallic plate and screw here and here. Uh, but the screws and the plates are no longer there. They have been removed. So, so yeah, that's that. I believe that answers the question about the scar on my hand. <coughs> okay. Para, please, what were you and Cross gossiping about at the techno party? Um, I don't remember that conversation, honestly. To be very candid. I need questions. Who, are you friends with White Money? Yes. White Money is a friend of mine and will always be a friend of mine, for sure. All the way. How did you feel when Nini made fun of the scar on your hand? I didn't even know she made a fun of, um, fun of the scar on my hand. Honestly, I didn't know that. Any endorsements yet? Oh, it's lots in the pipeline. Um, <coughs> keep the questions coming. No question. Me, no say me, I'll be yeah. fine, man. <laughs> yeah, fucking idiot. Then the guy has no questions. They say, since fans, they call now. Maybe they ask our yeah. question. <laughs> I 
I'm a cross nation. <laughs> I'm a patriot. So I'm ask a cross questions. nation. What's your like question? Say, if I say like, Nepa don't take light. Who don't? Nepa take light. This like car. Okay, they don't. They don't bring light again. Nepa don't come back. <laughs> Nepa don't come back. So okay. I'm gonna talk now. Uh -huh. So as I be your fan now, we can ask uh, you a question. What is the? What are you most scared of in this life? Yes. What I'm most scared of in this life. Yes. What are you is, most scared of? What I'm most scared of in this life is failing the people who have invested in me yeah. and failing myself at the end of the day after a lot of work has been put in by me on yeah. myself. That's my Chai, biggest Chai. fear. When was the yeah. last time you had sex? <laughs> Don't lie, you. We are patrons. We don't like you. Like generally, you don't lie to us. Don't lie to us. <clears throat> Tell us the truth. When was the last time you had sex? Be honest, because we are your fans, yeah. and we we'll know. We we'll know when you're lying. Absolutely, yeah, yeah. Yes. Sure. So tell us when was the last time you had yeah. sex? <laughs> the last time I had sex was before the Big Brother house. <laughs> Oh my God, Jesus Lord! Oh my God, guys! <laughs> Why? Why you don't believe me? Uh, our general is lying to us, so he's leading us astray. <laughs> <laughs> Petrot, he said before he went into the house, "You've been out for how many weeks? Four I, weeks now. Four weeks. I've not, I've not had or five weeks. No. I hey, haven't. Jesus is Lord. Okay." Petrus, you heard it from our general. He said he hasn't had sex. So we'll leave it like that. In that case, I'll take my leave and then uh, I'll see you on the other side. I'll see you on the other Teachers. side. <laughs>